I'll say in many words. <laughs> you gonna translate him? Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, of course. Great fight. That's what I heard. New year. I'm ready for new year. I think same like last year. Great year. Hope great fight. I hope I have a lot of great fights. Fight. I'm ready. I mean, uh, all of us sitting at this table, you know, our choice for fight of the year was Gennady. I mean, he made four title defenses, had four impressive KO victories. I believe he was the only fighter that was uh, in the running that made a, an existing champion vacate a title when uh, Daniel Gill decided not to, to fight Gennady but to take a different fight in Australia. Uh, you know, a fight like uh, Ishida, a guy that was never stopped before, now you knock him out in three rounds. And then you had a fight like uh, Matthew Macklin, who was clearly you know, top five, top ten uh, middleweight, had proven himself against Sergio Martinez and Felix Sturm. Gennady had the same result, knock out three. And I think Abel will tell you that uh, as Gennady's perceived competition gets better, just like with a Macklin fight, when Macklin was a very solid, dangerous middleweight contender, uh, that's when you'll see the best of Gennady come out. And so if everything goes the right way, February 1st, against Adama, we're, we're looking forward. It'd be really, uh, he said, you know, if Cotto has a hard time making the fight with Sergio, that he would step in either against Cotto or against Sergio. And, um, you know, that's a great fight. It's a great unification fight with Sergio Martinez. Sergio kind of has the mantle of, uh, uh, you know, considered uh, what he's accomplished as a top middleweight. But you know, we clearly think that Gennady's a top middleweight at this time. And so he's ready to take any, any challenge and uh, fight anyone that makes sense. Uh, for him to increase his, uh, to increase the profile and to prove that he's the best middleweight in the world today. Like I said, at that point, we can uh, we can open up to questions uh, for either the fighters or for uh, for Abel, and I'll be happy to answer any questions on the business with the motions. The uh, January 18th telecast starts at 10:45 p.m. Eastern time, and we're going to delay it to our West Coast feed also at 10:45. But most cable and satellite companies carry the East Coast feed, so. Customers can watch it at 745 on the web.